Question 24. So, we know that the area of this sector equals 20 pi. So, um, if this had been a whole circle, its area would be pi r squared, pi times the radius squared, but it's only 50 degrees worth, so the proportion we want of the circle is 50 over 360. So we know that 50 over 360 times pi r squared equals 20 pi. So divide through by pi, and we get 50 over 360 times r squared equals 20. So divide through by 50 over 360, and we get r squared equaling 1, 4, 4 square root r equals 12. So the radius here is 12. Now we want to know the perimeter of this um, um, sector, so that's going to be a 12 length here and a 12 length here, and we just need to add on this curvy bit here. Now if we were looking at the circumference of the whole circle, the circumference would be pi times the diameter, so pi times 24, the diameter. But again we only want 50 out of 360 degrees worth, so that is the length of the, the curved line AB. So the total perimeter is 12 plus 12 plus this here which is 34.4719 dot 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 so to three significant figures that's 34.5 because we round the four up because of the seven